Hello guys, welcome to Pokedex Trivia. With me today I have Admiral Black. And of course, Sherbler. Yo. And today they're gonna see if they know about Pokemon or not. And the loser will be embarrassed and the winner will be hoisted up. All right, number one. The thick arms of this hot-blooded Pokemon can deliver punches. Go ahead. Found the door? No. Uh, do you want me to finish the question? Yes. Sure, what? Okay. The thick arms of this hot-blooded Pokemon can deliver punches capable of obliterating a dump truck. Uh, Doranitan? Yeah. Jesus. Wow. <laughs> Gee, that's, that's my points. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Nothing in there said anything that was a Tarmanitan, so I gave it five points. I thought it would be a Machoke or a Potty type. What did you say? I said a uh, Coppador because okay. he has big arms. So I, I didn't even hear what your answer was. I just knew it was wrong because you didn't let me finish. <laughs> and the question literally, like, nothing about it says that it was a Tarmanitan. The second one, what it gave it away, which was... This Pokemon's power level rises along with the temperature of its fire, which can reach 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit. I don't, I don't know if that would have given it away or not. All right, number two. It's the male that raises the offsprings. While this Pokemon are racing young, the spine on their backs secretes thicker and stronger poison. Admiral. Cedra? It is Cedra. You get two points. What? Okay. <laughs> Number three, displaying amazing teamwork, they follow the order of their boss as they all help out in the search for their favorite berries. Sherbler. Sure, Passimian? Yes. Oh wow, you guys are doing way better than Brad and uh, <laughs> you guys are doing way better. Number four, it probes its surroundings with all of its senses, except one, it doesn't use its sense of sight. This Pokemon kicks are set to separate souls from bodies. <laughs> Whoa! You guys want me to what? read that again? Uh, you can read it again. Okay. It probes its surrounding with all of its senses, except one. It doesn't use its sense of sight. This Pokemon kicks are set to separate souls from bodies. Kicks that separate souls from bodies. Uh, Sharpler. Medicham? It is not me. Mudsdale? I'm, it's not Mudsdale. Here's the second entry. Okay. As it dashes through the night, this Pokemon absorbs the life force of sleeping creatures. It craves silence and solitude. Marshadow? No, it's not Marshadow. Uh, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna say Shifter? And it's not Shifter, it was Spectrire. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Guys, don't forget, you can ask for a clue after your first okay. guesses. See, I thought it was a horse, that's why I said Mudsdale. Yeah, I, I just I, you're, you're pretty close. Yeah. Yeah, don't forget, you can ask for a clue after I read the first phrase and you both get that wrong, then. Okay. Uh, it just lowers the score, so. All right, number five. The member of the trio spends all of their time together. Each one has a slightly different taste and nectar. <laughs> okay. Can you read it one more time for me? Oh uh, yeah. The members of the trio spend all of their time together. Each one has a slightly different taste and nectar. But this is one Pokemon, right? Yes. Okay. You, you can't ask for hints yet. Wait, what, right? it, what do you mean if it's one Pokemon? You you mentioned uh, oh I see what you're saying yeah, trio yeah, yeah. so yeah. <clears throat> okay do trio nope not trio. okay <laughs> that's a good guess I would guess that too yeah it's a bird so I can see the gears turning <laughs> just go ahead, go ahead and read the second okay. I I got nothing. It ceaselessly gathers nectar from sunrise to sundown, all for the sake of the queen and the swarm. Is it, is it Cumbie? Yes. Okay. That's one point. <laughs> I really thought you were... The nectar gave it away for me when I first but read But they are trios. There's three Cumbies. Cumbies come in threes. 
Oh, uh, you know what? They do have three little faces on them. I was I was originally thinking Oricorio because I think they drink nectar in order to change forms. That's yeah, good. That's you good. you yeah. mentioned Trio, and I was like, that doesn't make sense because yeah. there's four of them. That makes sense. <laughs> Number six. It's fur, or I'm sorry. It makes fur balls that crackle with static electricity. It stores them with berries and tree holes. Admiral. Pachirisu? Holy shit, yeah. What the fucking dare told you it's a Pachirisu? <laughs> that was gonna be my guess. <laughs> I was trying to make it... I wrote this question so that... Originally... Looked, <laughs> Sorry, God. So it looked like it was uh, more Peko. Uh, I thought it was a cat you were initially... Uh, yeah, but when you said driving. tree, I was like, oh, okay. But I was like, there's no... I don't think there's an, like, an electric cat that would do something with a tree. Okay. Wow, that, that, I'm amazed with that one. Number seven. It swims by rotating its two tails like a screw. When it dies, its flotation. Diesel? Yes. That's one point. The horn on a male's forehead contains a powerful poison. This is a very cautious. Nito Reno? I'm sorry? Nito Reno? Uh, no. Do you want me to ask a question? Okay. The horn on a male's forehead contains a powerful poison. This is a very cautious Pokemon, always straining. It's large ears. Niran. Yes. <laughs> male. <laughs> is Ran the male? It, well, the first Nidoran, one. Ran. There's the, the Nidoran first, male and female. Yeah. Uh, the first one, it's. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Charler's winning just because he's getting the big ones and you're getting wow. the little ones. So I guess that. That should have been my point. Uh, number nine. If it charges at an enemy, the hairs on its back stand up straight. It's very sensitive to sound. I feel like that could be anything. It can. I don't know. Zebra strike? It is not zebra strike. Okay. Uh. Oh, I think I know what it is. Shinx? It is not Shinx. Although its legs are short, it brought Yamper? No. You want me to finish? Surely. Go ahead. <laughs> you might let me finish the question. <laughs> Although its legs are short, its rugged hooves prevent it from slipping even on icy roads. Read it again for me, sorry. Uh, Although so its sorry. legs <laughs> You sneaky little... Although its legs are short, it rugged hoof its rugged Hooves prevent it from slipping even on icy grounds. You slick. <laughs> you slick. I know who it is too. Give me a clue. Uh, <laughs> swine Pokemon. Oh, um. Swine up? Or Pillow Swine? It was Pillow Swine, yeah. so you don't get it. Yeah. Is that who you're gonna guess that, bro? Oh, yes. wait, you didn't get that. And last one, number 10. This Pokemon has a complete control over electricity. There are, oh, I thought you were slapping the thing. I'm sorry, let me start over. <laughs> you always like press the button, so I just stopped. <laughs> this Pokemon has complete control over electricity. There are tales of this Pokemon nesting in the dark depths of the pitch black thunderclouds. Thunders? Nope. Oh no, I think I know who it is. <laughs> Oh! Uh, Zapdos? Yes. Fuck! <laughs> I knew it! Oh. There's only literally like two Pokemon that actually stay in Thunderclouds. So, we got Admiral with a whooping six points. And uh, we have. That's it? <laughs> yeah, you got. His first point was. His first question was five. Yeah, because it was three. <laughs> Uh, Sherbler walked out with 12 points. You are the winner. Woo! <laughs> Woo! So, Sherbler got the first question, which was five. Then he got another different question, which was three points. Then he got another three points, and then he got a one point. You got a two point. Then you got a one. Then you got a two, and then you got a one again. So how many questions did he get right overall? Uh, he got, he got four questions. You guys got the same amount of questions. Wow, so we got the same amount of questions right, <laughs> but somehow his points are double wide. Okay, all right, all right. All right, guys, so there you have it. Here's your winner is 
Sherbler. How do you feel, Sherbler? I feel uh, I feel pretty good. There were some in there that I was like, random stab in the dark that uh, I didn't think would be it, but I'm not surprised. I call it BS. <laughs> BS. <laughs> BS, man. All right, guys. We'll see you guys next time in more Pokédex trivia.